life-saving equipment. Life jackets are stored in passenger and crew cabins in or on top of the wardrobe. As life jackets vary from ship to ship, you should familiarize yourself with those on board the Ocean Majesty, as you will probably have to show passengers how to put theirs on, if only in the passenger lifeboat drill following embarkation. Place the life jacket over your head with the larger side in front. The letter A or B should be visible together with a number. This relates to the muster station to which a passenger has been assigned and the number of their lifeboat. The cabin number is also shown on the front of the jacket. Put both arms through both loops on either side. Take the straps behind your back and cross them over. Bring the straps forward, loop over twice and tie firmly across the front in the groove in a bow. Each life jacket is equipped with a manually operated safety light which is activated by pulling the short white plastic cord. There is also a whistle for attracting attention. There are retro-reflective tapes for visibility at night and a strap looped at the base of the head for recovery purposes. Children under 12 years old or weighing less than 32 kilos need a child's life jacket. If you have to jump into the water wearing your life jacket, you should hold the collar of your life jacket down with one hand and protect your airwaves by pinching your nose with the other. Check the water below is clear of debris and people. Look straight ahead and take one big step, crossing your legs as you descend. Hold the collar of your life jacket down with one hand, pinching your nose with the other. Check the water below is clear. Take one big step, crossing your legs as you descend. If you find yourself in the water, try to board a lifeboat or life raft as soon as possible. If you cannot, move clear of the water entry area, activate the light, and use the whistle on your life jacket to attract attention. Do not swim aimlessly, as swimming increases heat loss, but float as still as possible. If it is necessary to swim, do so on your back with an easy, rowing arm motion. Do not waste energy using your legs, keep them relaxed and together. It is always preferable to board survival craft dry to avoid the dangers of hypothermia caused by loss of body heat. Cold water immersion suits are designed to protect personnel who have to jump into the water directly and are located in lifeboats 1 and 2. Their two main properties are insulation and buoyancy and they allow survival for several hours in ice cold water. The 
The suit is inflated by pulling the attached toggle sharply and blowing into the air pouch. There is a whistle and a light for attracting attention. The attached ropes can be used for recovering purposes.